The conversation continues. I'm your Nampa neighborhood reporter, Keith Burrell, and I attended the Nampa Airport Commission's regular meeting where they discussed the proposed concrete batch plant. The conversation continues around the proposed construction of a concrete batch plant in Nampa. This time it's among the Nampa Airport Commission, the immediate neighbors to the north of the proposed site. Is my concern the dust that would be kicked up causing visibility um, problems, um, the possibility of having to go around, pilots having to go around, um, just general safety issues. So I ask that they assure the airport that any of those safety issues would be addressed. Ultimately, the airport commission disapproves of the concrete batch plant being built. I ran into some of the people that I met out at the corner of Grays and Victory in my previous coverage, and they were encouraged by the airport commission's concerns with some feeling that the airport is their best and maybe only way of stopping the approval process. It was encouraging uh, because um, they had a lot of the same concerns that we have as neighbors. And I feel like the Nampa Airport's one of the pride and joys of Nampa. I mean, they have the Warhawk Museum, they have the restaurant. The committee discussed concerns of visibility, corrosion to the aircraft, the view from a potential new terminal, and the effect of dust on plexiglass windscreens. Some neighbors' concerns being far more personal than the aesthetics of the area. Okay, so for me personally, um, I have scarring in my lungs. And putting in this plant will significantly impact air quality in the area and my ability to go outside and work in the yard. It'll also impact my ability to uh, play with my neighbors who uh, a little girl has a tracheotomy and she's going to have to deal with with the dust that's created from that. Some are already considering next steps should the plant be approved by planning and zoning. Ultimately moving, which is really sad because um, we've lived here for three years and put a ton of blood, sweat and tears in our house. So it would be really sad to feel like we were being pushed out. The committee will be collecting input from the public as well as interested parties and will submit their packet to the Planning and Zoning Committee before February 20th. From the Nampa Airport, I'm your Nampa neighborhood reporter, Keith Burrell for Idaho News 6.